Cody and Robin Brown are not to be trusted, TLC fans agree, and as the show seems to reveal more of them, Sister Wives fans feel their real personalities become obvious. That gets people questioning if they are narcissistic crybabies or ruthless, nasty people. Read on to find out their thoughts. TLC fans think Cody and Robin Brown seem transparently nasty. When it comes to all the wives leaving except Robin, there is a question of a division of assets. Bear in mind that Janelle and Mary Brown financed a good portion of the Coyote Pass property and Robin's house. As far as viewers can see, Robin put in nothing, but she wants everything the other wives have for herself. Sister Wives viewers saw Cody and Janelle clash over her home and property. While she owns more units of Coyote Pass than Mary, he estranged husband won't allow her to build on her land. However, he managed to find the money to finance new work in his favorite wife's mansion. Sister Wives fans hate that the TLC OGs could be scammed. On Reddit, some people question whether Cody and Robin Brown are just constantly whining crybabies, or whether they are downright evil. An OP seems to feel that they reveal their real personas in the squabbles about the Coyote Pass property. This season, fans saw way too much about Cody and Robin Brown that didn't sit well with them. So, it seems that most people agree they are not trustworthy, but some people argue that they can be both crybabies and narcissists at the same time. What are your thoughts about Cody and Robin Brown these days? Do you believe that they are simply really nasty people? Or, are they narcissistic crybabies? Do they have any intentions of being fair with the Coyote Pass property? Let us know in the comments. And, keep coming back for more Sister Wives news. In the captivating realm of reality television, where personal lives are laid bare for the world to dissect, the polygamous dynamics of the Brown family from Sister Wives have become a hotbed of speculation and debate. The recent episodes have not only showcased the complexities of plural marriage but have also raised questions about the behavior of Cody Brown and Robin Brown, leaving viewers to ponder whether they are crybabies seeking sympathy or simply navigating the challenges of a complex family structure. The term crybabies is often thrown around in the context of reality TV, where emotions are heightened, and conflicts are exaggerated for entertainment value. Some viewers argue that Cody and Robin, particularly in their interactions with the other wives, exhibit behaviors that may be perceived as melodramatic or seeking pity. Cody, as the patriarch of the family, has faced criticism for his seeming inability to balance the emotional needs of each wife. Some fans point to instances where he appears overwhelmed by the demands of plural marriage, questioning whether he is genuinely struggling or playing up the challenges for the cameras. On the other hand, Robin, the newest addition to the family, has been a source of both sympathy and skepticism. While some viewers empathize with her position as she navigates the intricacies of her relationships with Cody and the sister wives, others accuse her of manipulative behavior and as playing fans the victim. engage in heated discussions online, it becomes evident that the portrayal of the Browns on sister wives is a delicate dance between reality and entertainment. The blurred lines make it challenging for viewers to discern whether the family's struggles are genuine or strategically amplified for the sake of the show. The term nasty people also enters the discourse, reflecting the frustration of some viewers with the interpersonal dynamics within the Brown family. Accusations of selfishness, insensitivity, and a lack of empathy have been hurled at both Cody and Robin, igniting a debate about the ethical implications of putting such personal struggles on public display. Reality TV thrives on conflict, drama, and the emotional roller coaster of real life situations. While some argue that the Browns willingly entered this world and should be prepared for the scrutiny, others question the morality of exploiting deeply personal struggles for the sake of entertainment. In the midst of the controversy, it is essential to remember that reality TV offers only a curated glimpse into the lives of its subjects. The narrative is shaped through editing, and certain nuances may be lost in the process. As viewers, it becomes crucial to separate the characters on screen from the real people behind the roles they play. Whether Cody and Robin Brown are crybabies seeking sympathy or individuals grappling with the challenges of a plural marriage, 
Sister Wives continues to captivate audiences with its portrayal of the highs and lows of polygamous living. The drama unfolds, leaving viewers with a mix of fascination, empathy, and a lingering question. In the pursuit of entertainment, where do we draw the line between genuine struggles and scripted narratives?